Contractors through their smartphones could just be the beginning. The experts I spoke to say micro could be next. I am freaked out by this, but I'm more curious than anything else. So let's go speak to the brains behind this new technology. Hi, yeah. Hey. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Come on in. Thank you. Biotech is a UK-based tech company that develops microchips as small as a pill, which can easily be inserted into our bodies to store data. Yeah, so Stephen Northam is the company's founder. He's showing me an X-ray image of the microchip inside his very own hand. So we imagine. 10, 15 years of time, this could be very commonplace. Could you have one chip replace keys, money, passport, and then you just leave the house just with your hand? Once the eight kilobyte chip is in your hand, it emits low frequency signals read by a scanner that identifies the unique ID in the microchip. Stephen uses his microchip in the office, at home, and even to start his car, but he's not using it to monitor his employees. But microchip employees is gaining traction. Take US company 3 Square Market as an example. As of last year, 92 of its 196 employees have been microchipped. 3 Square says employees can use the chip to pay for office snacks and to enter the building. But take it a step further and chip could potentially track employees' lunch breaks and if connected to a GPS, they could track their movements too. That's a red flag for the growing number of people concerned about the security of their personal data. But Stephen tells me they've already thought that through. It can be easily read with a mobile phone. You can wipe the data, you can change it, you can encrypt it, password protect it. So from our point of view, it's probably more safe than having your data in the cloud because it's only in your hand, a memory stick inside your body. If we can have the Attorney General, in his opinion, find that a subcutaneous space implant is non-invasive, then we could do that. I can guarantee you the program will ultimately be used to involuntarily place tracking information on people.